Right, so what is up guys, SDPZ here, and today we're bringing you a video on the most broken gun in Warzone, the most broken gun for a very, very long time. This thing is like the FAMAS shotgun, effectively. A bit less broken, but I think the idea that the floor loot version of it is so overpowered and it's so easy to get a hold of just completely ruins the game. Of course, I don't advocate using this gun, but you've got to go with the trend. You die to this gun every game if you don't use it, so you've got no choice. As scumbag as it is, it's just the meta at the minute, and of that, of course, is the Origin 12. Today, I'm going to be showing you the best class loadout for this gun, and hopefully you guys do enjoy that. And if you do go on to use this gun, and you do think it's sick, drop a comment, let me know. Drop a like on the video if you do like the class and end up using it. That would be sick to see. Hopefully, you can show some amazing support in this video, just like you did with the most recent James Daniels video. That would be fantastic. So, let's jump into the class. Right, so here we have it. The Origin 12 uh, slash Kilo Overkill class. This is the way you're going to be running this gun. Of course, I have got the Engraven Blueprint, which... Let's be honest, uh, it looks pretty good. It look it does look pretty nice. Um, if we get the if we uh if we get the uh, the old right here we go, look. It does look pretty nice, the old engraving blueprint, the white and blue theme uh, from of course the uh, battle pass from this season. It's a very nice looking gun, very uh very very it's just very nice, very nice. Uh, and of course these are the attachments you're gonna be running on it. So you're gonna be running the choke as your muzzle, the forge tack impaler as your barrel, which of course is the last one. Choke is um one of the middle attachments. We're going to be using the Merc foregrip on the side for recoil control and aim down spite. The Impaler, uh, sorry, gives you damage range and a tighter pellet spread so that you can shoot further and do damage at a further range while the pellets stay closer together so they are more likely to do a heavy impact. The Choke increases that as well, damage range and tighter pellet spread, so the same effect again. The 5 middle up laser includes it, um, increases your hip fire accuracy and your sprint to fire speed. So this can be very useful when you're just rushing a building and you're not going to be aiming down sights. You're just going to be spamming the absolute living life out of this. You could use the tack laser, um, the A down sight, aim and stability and aim walking steadiness. But I tend to think you're probably not going to be using it as much uh, as maybe the 5mm laser in my opinion. And then of course we've got no stock behind my face cam. You can't quite see it but it does improve your movement speed and aim down sight speed. Which is very important uh, as this obviously is going to be a replacement for your MP5 as your close range gun. So, is this going to beat out your MP5? At close range, yes it does. It's so powerful. It's so broken. It is so... You die to this gun every game. Let's just accept it now. As much of a scumbag move as it is to use this gun, it is the only thing you can use in this game. Everybody is using it. You're not going to be on your own. You die to this gun every single game without fail. You will come into against whether you're playing solos, duos, trios, quads. Everybody is running this as their secondary. Of course, then you can use whichever primary you do fancy. Of course, you know my favourite one is the Kilo with the monolithic, the Syngard uh, Arms 19.8 inch Prowler Barrel, the VLK 3x Optic, the 60 round mags and the Commando Foregrip. I have done a video on this previously, so if you do want to see a more in-depth talk about the Kilo and how effective this gun is, then of course we already have that video on the channel, so go and have a look for it. But this gun is absolutely fantastic, probably one of the best assault rifles in the game, and paired with this Origin, it is just ridiculous. Of course, we're going to run in EOD, Amped, and Overkill as our perks. Pretty standard perk setup there. And, of course, the C4, the, literally the only lethal, really, to run in the game. And then the Heartbeat Sensor, pretty useful. Obviously, like I've said, probably change to stuns on your later game loadout. Because everybody is probably going to have Ghost by this point. However, for the start, you're definitely going to be wanting that. This gun is absolutely broken. Let me know what you guys think of it. It is just disgustingly good. Um, go and try it in-game. I'm sure you're going to have a lot of fun with it. You're going to feel gross using it, but... If you can't beat them, join them, they say. Right, guys, so that is today's video, the Origin 12 class. It is so broken. Go and try this in-game. Like I said, if you do enjoy it, drop a like on the video and comment down below how you get on with this gun, how many kills you can get with it over your next few games. It'll be interesting to see. Thank you very much for your support on the recent video. Um, the James Daniels video did absolutely insane, and we also hit 1,300 subscribers since uploading that, so it's been absolutely mental, and he actually commented on the video, which was just mad. It's been a bit of a mad few days. Thank you very much for your support. It's been insane. Uh, we have now opened a Discord server, um, which I'll put in the top link of the description. I've opened a Discord for you guys. If you are, if you do want to join it, just be fans of the channel. Of, um, I'll put the invite link in the description so you can join the Discord. Uh, it's just SDPZ squad, the Discord. We've got 12 people in there at the minute. We just talk about my channel uh, and so on. And if you guys want to self-promote your own channels to other creators in there, that is absolutely fine. So go and join the Discord. Let me know how you get on with this gun. Thank you very much for watching and drop a like on the video if you have enjoyed. Just thank you for being here. Thank you for your recent support. I wanna and take peace. it on it. I'm falling. The cityscape by night. Wanna catch in my photos. Where you go? Every corner twice as bright. There'll be my treasures forever. When I can't hold.